Amanda's arrival at St. Joseph's Hospital in Lowell. Um, definitely the best day of my life. Um, and on that day, Amanda gained um, <clears throat> a newly minted best friend, her mom. Um, from the beginning, Amanda has been Judy's primary concern, bestowing all the love, care, comfort, and support that a mother can give. And it continues to this day. I remember our photo shoot with your mom on the beach, our infamous Cape uh, trip, our trips to Black Island, and how we always seem to buy the same clothes and wear the same thing. And those of you who were here at the rehearsal yesterday, we were pretty much wearing the exact same thing and it wasn't planned. first thing that came to me was, you know, Joe and Amanda have had significant life-changing events recently from when they announced they were going to get married to when, you know, to today. And, you know, they bought an amazing house in Dunstable, you know, a house that is perfect for starting a family and raising some children. And then, of course, you know, we talked about uh, the birth of Michael and, uh, yeah, I echo some of the comments there. I mean, I've never been around a baby that's been so happy and so enjoyable. It just really, it really puts me in awe. Someone that makes the morning stay. Someone that pulls the darkness away. Oh, I lost, I'd give it all for fun. I know now that I need it space. After years of searching for their soulmate, they actually finally found themselves and got together to celebrate that love with a wedding. It's the most extraordinary gift we can think of. It was an extraordinary gift for these two. But then something even more extraordinary happened. Joe and Amanda began to build a life together. They encountered new challenges they never faced alone and discovered new joys they've never ever dreamed of. Then they made a tiny human together, a beautiful son, Michael. And they made a home as a family and filled it with laughter and warmth. I, Joe, promise to you my love and honor to support you through good times and bad times. I, Amanda, promise to love and honor you to support you through good times and bad times, to shoulder our burdens as if they were my own. A year ago, you promised to walk life's path together. Today, you know that you're only made a start on this journey. As you commit to each other, keep your hearts open to the extraordinary gifts that lie ahead. It is with pleasure that I conclude this ceremony of the renewing of the vows of Joe and Amanda that have joined you and bind you as husband and wife. You can kiss. <laughs> Amanda, she's up for a good adventure. If anyone should know that, it's me. And Joe, you probably know that now too. being part of and witnessing the most is the love story between you and Joe. May you and your children be blessed with health and happiness and your friends be many and true. And I think today's a manifestation that I don't have to worry too much about that. May God bless you and Michael Joseph. It's been incredible to watch someone find the one who is their perfect complement. Amanda and Joe, you are that perfect pair. 
I've been lucky enough to witness your love and admiration for one another. Together, you bring life to those around you. Here's to the past for all that you've learned. Here's to the present for all that you share. Here's to the future for all that you look forward to. I love you both. Congratulations. Cheers.